Hi guys, it's Mrs. Powermore and I'm going to show you how to do some paper weaving. Now what you're going to need to do is get some paper and cut it into strips. I've already luckily got some coloured strips of paper here. So you want it about the same width as this, so probably about one and a half to two centimetres wide and at least that long, although you can go longer if you want to do a longer weaving. Um, you can cut up any sort of paper you've got. So it could be junk mail, can be a piece of newspaper, um, a bit of recycled paper, doesn't really matter. So um, if you want to get that and some scissors and cut those up, and then you're going to need either sticky tape or a glue stick, depending on what you've got. Okay, grab those things and I'll meet you back here. Okay, so I've got strips of paper. Now I'm using two contrasting colours, pink and yellow, so you can clearly see what I'm doing. But you don't have to do that if you haven't got that. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to tape down. I'm going to tape mine down to the paper just so you can see clearly. You can also glue it down just on the top, on the end, but just so it's I'm just going to tape mine down and you don't have to have it joined but just so it stays in position I'm going to just stick mine down here we go so you can see that they all lift off and then I've taped the right number that they're about the same length going across here so what we do is we go over, under, over, under, over, under, over, under. So the first thing I want you to do is to tuck your first one underneath here. And if you want to, you can use a bit of blue tack or something, but it might just help you if you tape it down just so you don't get um, the paper moving around on you. So you go under the first one over the second one and then we're going to go under the next one so you need to lift that one up we go over the next one under and then over the next one so we've gone under over under over under over now the next one we do we're going to do the opposite so we're we've gone under here so we're going to go over here so we want to go under the next one so I'm going to lift that up and then we are going to go over that one under the next one over and then under starts to look like a checkerboard so we just keep going until we have filled up the whole square and it can probably fit one more here so going under, over, under, over and over. Now, when you've got it all secure, you can use tape or glue to glue down the end bits. So if I was going to use glue, I would just glue down these pieces onto here and glue these just so they don't break apart or move and glue them down or you can use a bit of tape and that's your paper weaving now what you can do is you can then fold it up you can make it into a basket you could create a bigger pattern and do a quilt of them and have a whole row of it um, so you can really take this, but really it's just getting this idea of under over, which is great for your fine motor skills and your math skills. So have fun, guys.